Woo, cold morning today. All right, guys, let's do some work to the B6 today. So like all of my cars, I do not like the amber lens in the headlights, or if it's on the bumper, then I don't like that either. But today, I want to remove the amber lens here in the uh, headlights. So what I'm gonna do is like I did on the B7RS4, get one side done first, show you the comparison of what it looks like with it in and with it removed and then show you uh, in as much detail as I can of how I remove the uh, ambulance. So let me go ahead and get one side out first. All right guys, so before I get this video started, it would be great if you guys can help support my channel by hitting that red subscribe button. Thanks guys. Now let's get started on getting those red or not red, those amber lens out of the headlights. All right guys, so I got that passenger side out. You see there, up closer. Doesn't it look so much cleaner without those amber lens? Man, so much better. Now let me show you the driver's side. You see the difference. And there goes the driver's side with the amber lens out in there still. Dang, so much cleaner. It's actually not that difficult. It does take some time, patience, and some finesse, but it's actually very durable. So I actually did not take apart the lens off of the housing because if you guys know, these, the B6, has like a perma seal type of seal. And it's very hard to basically uh, take it apart because the seal actually does not get um, loosened up when you uh, apply heat to it. So what I did was I decided to just pop out the amber lens while everything is still intact together. So what I did was basically crack the lens in half and just slid them out through the cracks there. So let me show you what it looks like now. So here's the lens and how it's cracked in half. And all of the tools that I use, a bunch of flat hip Phillips screwdrivers and a pick tool set. So the way I did it was I first so it's basically sits in like that. It has a tab down here, down here, and a tab right up there. I broke off the tab here first, and then I apply some pressure towards the middle here, cracked it into pieces. These pieces basically came apart from each other and uh, basically just shook it around. And then these, uh, I, I was able to shake it around and had it slide through the cracks of the headlights there and just basically pop it out from the back. So let me go ahead and start this driver's side and show you exactly as best as I can how I did it. Of course it will start to rain and get cold. Let's just get this headlight out real quick and work it in the garage. So the way you remove the headlight is just remove four screws and the wiring harness in the back of the headlight and the headlight should just pop out. Not like the B7RS4 where you have to take out the front bumper. So this one would be much easier. So there's one right here, two right here, three right there. That one you just need to loosen it. Don't need to take it all the way out. And there's another one back down over here. Let's see if you can see it. Anyways, this is back down there. And there are T30 screws. So the two back down here, just loosen it up. And these two up here, you need to pull all the way out, pull it out and unplug it back right here unplug it this guy here so let me go ahead and take this headlight out real quick all right headlights are out now let's get these amber lenses out and close the garage because it's freaking cold out there it's actually the next day i didn't get to start on it yesterday but i'm going to try and get it done this morning because i kind of need the car to drive to work today the weather is crazy outside right now and the garage is kind of cold so i'm just going to try and get it done inside of the house first thing i'm going to do is take off the two back covers here and also remove this bulb all this this one is held in by this metal clip here held in by this metal clip here and this one you just twist it counterclockwise and then pull it out so let me get those off real quick okay so now let's get started got those three uh covers off and that little bulb out the first time I do is use this pick tool right here and kind of go up top through here and have this edge here kind of hook up top at here and break off the little tab that holds the top portion of the uh, 
reflector into the housing. So let me show you. If you remove here, you kind of see that right there, that little tap. So what you want to do is kind of break that off. Break the break the lens off that tab so that when you crack it, it will just basically fall off and you're able to wiggle a lot of the headlight. So let me kind of stick it in there and show you guys how uh, and where to position that um, pick tool. All right, so it's in there. So it's actually not through that hole, but through this hole here. You see how it's kind of positioned there? And then you see the pick tool. Oh, the lighting sucks right here so it's kind of on that edge and what i'm gonna do is keep applying pressure inwards and break it off of that tab so let me go ahead and break it off of that tab real quick all right so just got that top tab broken let me show you here you see how it's moving in now so now uh, let's move on to the next step so the next thing to do is use this hook pick tool uh slide it through here and hook it onto the middle of the uh, lens and try your best to apply pressure there and basically crack it in half like I showed you in the beginning of the video of the other side that I cracked in half. So let me show you real quick how I did that. So just kind of insert it here. Let me see if you can, let me see, you see it's coming out here. And just grab the center like how I'm grabbing it right there right now. Just continue to apply pressure and just crack it. So let me go ahead and crack that and show you what it looks like after I crack it. Alright, just got this cracked in half. Now, we should just be able to wiggle out through the front headlight. You see how it's just moving now? And basically, the largest crack that I found was through back here. So, all I'm going to do is just wiggle out through that side and pull it out from through the back side. So, let me go ahead and pull some out. All right, so looking through the back side, kind of slid one on that side already, so it should be more right there. Can you? No, it's not focusing. So not focusing that great, but anyways, it's already kind of slid into the slot, so now I can just grab it and pull it out. I just got them out. Like I said, through the back, just fish it throughout the back here of the back lens, and that's the end product. No amber corner lens. So much cleaner. Now I gotta get this headlight installed in the rainy and windy weather. So let me go ahead and put the headlight back together, you know, the bulbs and the back cover, and then install the headlights and show you what it looks like with both of them removed. So yeah, check out the weather. Windy, cold, and rainy. Anyways, pulled the B6A4 into the garage and getting ready to install the driver's side headlight and then I'll show you guys what it looks like all back together. All right, car is back together. Just double check to make sure all the lights work and they do. And the car is ready to go. Check it out. Just looks so much cleaner without those amber lens. So for now, I just threw in a clear bulb because it originally came with an amber bulb. But I do later in the future want to put in some switchbacks, but that's going to require some um, resistor wiring stuff. But that's going to be in later in a different video when I do plan to want to get into that little project. These are halogen headlights, so I do plan to put in a set of aftermarket HID, and I know that those would be good because I had it on my previous D6. All right, guys, so I hope that this video can help you guys out. I know that there's other ways to do this, including, you know, taking apart the headlight, but that's just a much longer process in my opinion. And the way that I did it was pretty fast, actually. As long as you, you know, take your time, and it'll, it's not that bad. You, 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 get, you get the hang of it. So comment down below and let me know what you guys think about the headlights now with those amber lights removed. Also, if you have any questions on how I actually did it in more detail or just have any questions about how I did it, go ahead and comment it down below and I'll try my best to help you guys out there too. Anyways, thanks for watching this video guys. Don't forget to subscribe to help support my channel and follow my builds. Comment any sort of feedback to help my channel grow and like this video if you find it helpful. Thanks guys. I'll see you guys in the next video.